Hello, you are watching Bar Hebo Math Genius Riddles. The equations quantity a plus b squares equal to quantity a plus one multiplies quantity b minus one. A, b are real numbers. Find the value of a and b. It looks easy to guess the answer. But in this video, please find the math operation to get the result. Would you please to find the value of a and b? Pause the video and try it while you are ready. Keep watching the video to get the result. The given equations quantity a plus b square equal to quantity a plus 1 multiplies quantity minus 1. To find the value of a and b, we may develop all the quantities, then try to refactorize to find the answer, such as become a square plus 2ab plus b square equal to ab plus a plus b plus 1. But I don't plan to do that. Let's find other approach. Back to the given equations, compare the two quantity in the right side of equations a plus 1 and b minus 1. If add up these two items, we will eliminate numbers 1 and minus 1, become a plus b. Then we force them to make the relations with the quantity in the left side. So we define n equal to a plus 1, n equal to b minus 1 and n plus n equal to a plus b. After that, substitute a plus 1 by n, b minus 1 by n, and a plus b by n plus n to the given equations. It become quantity n plus n squares equal to m n. Then develop the square items and move the item to the same size as m square plus m m plus n square equal to zero. Now we have m square and n square, these two square items. I'm going to merge m m to one square items. So rewrite m m equal to two times one over two times m m. Put this item into m square item group, then add quantity 1 over 2 n squares into this item group and the mass 1 over 2 n squares to n square group. Then merge all of these, these items become quantity n plus 1 over 2 n square plus 3 over 4 n square equal to 0. A, B are real numbers, so M, M is real number 2. If Add up these two square items is equal to zero. The solution is three over four n square equals to zero, then n equal to zero. And uh, n plus one over two n equal to zero. Substitute n by zero, get m equal to zero. And we define m equal to a plus one and n equal to b minus one. So 0 equal to a plus 1, a equal to minus 1, and 0 equal to b minus 1, b equal to 1. That's the answer we got. Do you find it? Hope you to enjoy the video. Thank you.